it's misty out there. On the side of the river, there's a lot of mist. Maybe we've got a chance. Maybe we've got a chance. Oh, we see out there, looks nice. When there's mist on the wicket, let's play cricket. When there's mist on the wicket, let's play cricket. Come on, baby. We've got mist. So there she blows, just sat in the mist quite beautifully this morning, uh, about half an hour from sunrise at the minute, maybe a little bit longer actually, no about half an hour from sunrise yeah so what I'm hoping here is that the light, um, the sun is rising on the right hand side of this image and what I'm hoping is um, there's like a little, um, a little mountain or a little hill either side of the castle. So what I'm hoping is that the sun will spill down either side of the hill on the right hand side and backlight the castle. So the mist behind it will be lit up, which may silhouette the castle a bit better um, as it gets uh, lighter. And we might get a nice little bit of colour above the mist. Um, it's very orange to my right hand side, but not as orange at the minute. So hopefully you know, a bit more colour just above the mist would be quite nice as well. So, fingers crossed. This is going to be beautiful. Right, you can see it's starting to get a little bit brighter now and I've just taken a couple of test shots and I'll tell you what, this could be lovely. I think we've done made the right decision to stay here for now. It might be different when we drive past it and go down and it's in thick mist when we get back down there. But uh, for now, this is looking really nice. Let me show you this on the back of the camera. You can just see the castle's lovely silhouette with the mist behind it. It's a bit of soft mist in the front of it, but that's probably not going to be strong enough if I'd climbed up there. So yeah, so that's where we are. I don't know if I can be okay, careful what this will be like, but I'll give it a try. No, that's rubbish. It's trying, but it's a bit dark at the minute. You get the idea, it's down there in the mist. Just nicely silhouetted between the hills. It's one of these mornings where and um, we've all been there where it's the stick or twist scenario. So we've got a shot from here that's quite nice. I like it. And you can see the mist rolling in now, sort of around the castle. And you're just so tempted to go down to the original, the original plan, which is up the hill, uh, and see if you can get a shot from there as well. Um, and it's a real sort of stick or twist. Do I stay? Do I, you know, I've got one here, it's okay, but it could be better. I think when the sun comes up, it could be really nice. Or do you go down there and try and get a different perspective and a different shot, but risk that there might be no mist where you want it to be? I could do like a straw pole. Yeah, sometimes it just depends how you feel. It's just gut feeling sometimes. Um, I think we're going to stay here, is the bottom line, and stick out, stick this out for hopefully a slightly better shot than we've got at the minute. And when we go down past the castle, if it's misty there, then we'll probably have a quick scoot up the hill and see if we can get a, a second shot. If it isn't misty when we get down the castle, we continue on and do the woods because it does look like there's a lot of thick mist beyond the castle where the woods are. So we'll stick with the original sort of uh, original plan three, original plan three, whatever that is. See, the, is that the sorry? It's not a bit of dandruff in my hair though. It's actually the moon behind my hair, just up there. Um, yeah, so we'll stick with the. Third plan revisited twice. Plans. Plan. Oh my god. Talk about change of plan. This is now plan four. And look, we've come. And it looks beautiful. So we're, we're going to scoot up the hill. Oh. Sorry. We we'll have to get a move on. I'm going to scoot up over this hill over here. Hang it up before the uh, sun bursts through this lot. Could be mint. We're now on plan five. Okay, plan five. Oh <laughs> my God. What a good bit of timing that was. You know, 
there's a lot to be said for not wasting two hours over there on a hill like two miles away photographing it when you just rock up here about two seconds before sunrise you gotta love it when plan four comes together oh my god oh my giddy hand Some people are just lucky. That is amazing. Amazing. I mean, this is just absolutely epic. And we use that word a lot, particularly me in videos. But this is just absolutely outstanding. <laughs>